guys, how's it going? It's the Anime Over Analyst here, and in today's video, I am going to be doing my Nier Automata blind playthrough. This will be part four. So, last part, I basically ran up, ran into a robot orgy. The, the robots gave birth to not one, but two androids, but... It was like one android gave birth to another android before we brutally murdered the first one. Or after we brutally murdered the first one. Yeah. I'm, I'm wondering if violence is technically not the option to go, but I'm also bloodthirsty, so violence is the answer. Now, there is some kind of concern that I have right now, which is I'm starting to get some really nice stuff. But I can't use it all. I want to put it away somewhere so that if I die, I can access it. I have yet to find any way to put stuff away right now. So maybe you can put down in the comment section down below if there is something that maybe I have missed. Or maybe I'm just not able to yet. So that is definitely a worry that I have. All that being said, let's jump Right so, on into the game. What are my active quests? I've got 11B's memento, which is basically uh, 11B had died in that first battle, that, you know, the tutorial segment, so I gotta go and find her shit. And then improving communications, which actually seems pretty important. And then I believe I also have to go and uh, talk with the leader of the resistance, anyways. So, mm. probably just go back to the resistance stuff. I, I kind of want to fly again, but it doesn't seem like they will let me, so let's just jump into the pod here. Uh, transport resistance camp. Right. Look at it. Sexy. So. Operator to 2B. Come in, 2B. We need you to collect the materials required to improve the network environment. All right. You're going to need a rusty bolt, a small gear, and a spring. You should be able to find them. Uh, a broken key. Enemy. Once you have everything, or please spring. take it to the resistance leader, Anemone. Understood. I know it's a bit of a pain, but good luck. Target location data obtained. Marking on map. Okay. Operator 60 to 2B. Looks like you oh. found all the necessary parts <laughs> to improve our network environment. Nice work. You can conclude All right. your mission by bringing everything over to Anemone. Wow, that was easy. Okay, let's talk to Anemone. Heard about this from the bunker. These are the parts we need for our network structure. Thanks for bringing them over. Not, but it's not much, but I have a reward. Well, don't tell commanders. Probably against regulations. Hey, I leveled up to level nine. Simple gadget three. Eh, not bad. All that stuff is pretty good. I can't talk to Anemone? Oh, I've got... 2B to Operator 6O. Material handover complete. Copy that. Good work. I see the commander's as much okay. of a slave driver as ever. It's like she was built to be as efficient and hard-assed as possible. Oh, she's not so bad. Uh, are you serious? Totally serious. The commander actually lets a lot of things slide on the side. Like, did you know that she leaves piles of clothes strewn everywhere? The cleaning team is so sick of it. Oh, and she never performs regular maintenance on herself. A lot of the hard-ass nature you mention is just for show. How do you know all this? <laughs> I can't tell you that. Operator 6-0, out. Gotta say, I... I what the heck was all that about? I genuinely enjoy Operator 6-0. I really, really do. I really enjoy her uh, commentary. You heard from Jackass about your encounters in the desert. Good work. We don't have much enough, but I'm ready to room for you here. Hey! Pretty big. It's okay for us to get a room like this. We have permission, remember, plus we'll probably be stationed here for a while, so a bed won't go amiss. Why do androids need a bed? Need beds? Like, the whole personality factor kind of bothers me a little bit. 
I'm taking a break, guys. Taking a break. Probably still can't open it, to be honest, but... Yeah. Can't access it. Alright. I think there was... I was still supposed to talk to Anemone. Hanging in there? Alright, I guess not. I might just run around a little bit. Might kill some things. Here we go. Operator to 9S. This is 9S. Go ahead. I have an incoming message for 2B and 9S from the commander. Initiating playback. 2B, 9S. We've lost contact with several Yorha units that were on their way to the surface. Their black boxes are online, so we presume they're still alive. We've tracked the location of their signals, so I need all Yorha units on the surface to head over and investigate. All End right. transmission. Hmm. I heard something about that back at the Resistance camp. Target location confirmed. I'm worried about the other androids. We should probably check this out as soon as possible. What? Oh, okay. I don't- I was Loki a little bit confused on why we were fighting it. But, I'm not complaining. I mean, I have it set to aggressive, so that's probably why. Honestly, this is good practice for my uh, weapons, so... I'm not even mad. Even though I think that I'm not technically supposed to be fighting these guys. Also, I'm a little bloodthirsty. Like, they're so easy to pick off. They're so they're 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 incredibly easy to pick off. Why not? I've got some bad feelings about this. If I can't save it when I'm on like the world map here. Yeah. Alright, well. This'll be fun. Alright, can't do anything there. So far it's a pretty linear path. Climb up though. So, how am I gonna get my ass clapped this time? Alright, well this is interesting. What is going on here? Hell? It's it's just an amusement park. Why are we in Disneyland? This is very bizarre. What so are those? Oh. What the? Wow, this is weird. I I almost wasn't going to do anything, and then he attacked, and I was like, oh, that's right, I have him set. Oops. Move. Well, um, that was a bloodbath. Big, accept my love. Shattered earring. I might have killed the other one by accident. Probably shouldn't have killed that other one. Ah oh well. It, it's, there almost looks to be something right around here. You see what I mean? There's like some kind of path. At least according to the mini map. Oh, maybe it's this right here. Yeah, it's almost like there's some kind of path. But it won't let me access it. Okay. Crystal. I guess we're gonna go in. Hey, how's it going? Balloon. Congratulations, you're our first customer. Shattered earring. Alright. I must kill everything. Did they did it just respond? Balloon brother. Hold on a second, I think they're respawning. I don't think I can kill them. 
Okay. Very interesting. I, I can apparently hit it. I'm not gonna kill the. Not gonna kill him now. Back entrance machine. You have business here? No? Okay. Shh, don't shout. Can I help you? Now I'm all, like, goody-goody with the robots? Wait, can't kill her, balloon brother. Again? Yeah, I'm running into, like, the same ones. Balloon sister. I think I killed balloon sister. Come again. Father machine. Let's be happy together, together, together. Oh, what fun. That's so weird. All right, the, the the ones that have names, I'm not going to kill. It looks like there's some kind of side quest or quest over here, though. Along the side. You know, back where the, uh... Back out, back entrance, dude. Where does this corridor lead? I don't know, it's sketchy as fuck. Machine on break. What the heck? Hey, I, I ain't gonna disturb a man on break. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, I guess we're fighting this one. I did something. Clown machine, dangerous beyond here, broken, jump, danger. Here, what's up? Uh, we're, we're actually going to be passive. Or maybe not passive, but cautious. I'm really curious if I need to even kill this thing. Oh, missed, damn it. Get out of the way, get out of the way. Oops, damn. That was a pretty easy Goliath. That was a really easy Goliath. What's this? Was Some kind easy. of crystal? Analysis. It is a core fragment from the machine life form. It is similar in structure to a plant cell. A plant cell? Yeah, I kind of like my little bloodthirsty streak, not going to lie. It's very entertaining. Uh, oh, I've got full health. Okay. I was going to use, use like, the potion just to make sure that I was all good. Turned out I don't even need to worry, worry about that. Roller coaster. Humans sure are strange <laughs> creatures. Yes, we are, and I'm proud of it. Are we not gonna do anything with the roller coaster, though? Are we hey, not? To be? Yes. People who know me well usually call me Nines. So. Oh. So what do you think? Of? Oh. I mean, nines. It's totally okay. Nine I'm S. Good. Nines. Oh. Um. All right. Oh, that's adorable. Oh, okay. Well, we're, we're just gonna stand. We're just gonna stand on it. All right. All right.
records don't say anything about a machine like this. Nah, really. Getting, I'm kind of understanding how it works though, a little bit. Ah, fuck. Fuck, fuck. Where did it go? Where did it go? Where is it? What the fuck is this? I can't do shit. What the fuck? It'll affect our bodies as well. What the <laughs> fuck was to that? Those look like corpses. <laughs> Seriously being attacked with dead androids? Wait, I don't think. 2B, I'm detecting black box signals. They are dead. They've been turned into weapons. All right, this ends now. I'm very worried about destroying these things with black box signals. Because doesn't that mean they'll explode? I'm not even... Whoa! Oh shit! What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? I'm so confused! What the fuck? Why are we like this? Why are we like this? I I was doing so well. Why are we why are we doing top down? Ah, fuck. Analyze the enemy's hacking pattern. 
I'm going to try to hack it back. Keep it busy. You got it. I'll try. Now it's on fire. What the fuck? Come on. I got it. Did I get her? Affirmative. Go! I got her. Somehow. Oh, that was very interesting. I don't think there was a peaceful way to get through that one. I don't think there was a single peaceful thing. But that, that was weird. It Thanks was for the assist. Oh, you mean the hacking? No worries. Us scanners are pretty good at that kind of thing. I've got your back anytime. Such a interesting and scary boss fight. I'm so glad I didn't die in that boss fight. Very, very interesting. Well, y'all so, um, was like, fuck. What is it? That machine had some pretty weird things to say, huh? Yeah. It's almost it did. like it had actual emotion. The machines don't have feelings. You said Itch. that yourself. Yeah, I. I guess. But we do. We have. We, who are also said machines, have emotion. That was very disturbing, though, how it, like took control of and like it almost looked like it was trying to torture the other androids with the way that it, it was like tied around her dress all those androids tied to her what's this okay this may or may not be the way to go. I was hoping it wasn't. It would just be a side path. I was trying not to go the way that I was supposed to go. But we'll see. So it looks like this is like a quest thing for later. I'm, I'm too early. I'm too early to be there. I didn't think I'd be too early for a quest. But that's what happens when you don't go the path that you're pointed directly at. It just means I'll be back. Maybe <laughs> watch it be within the next five minutes. Hostiles. Maybe. I am not hostile. Huh? You defeated broken machine. You saved us. <laughs> this thing is awfully verbose for a machine. Mm -hmm. We repay you. Come to our village. Fine. Could we'll be go. A trap. Still. We should at least head over there and gather data, right? Yep. 
just feels like trap, but I mean, if it's a trap, I'll go around and beat them up. Gotta run, gotta run, gotta run. Running, 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 running. Ha, I'm getting ahead of it. Come on. So why don't the machines, or the aliens who created them, attack the bunker directly? They originally came here from outer space, right? Well, there are a few theories about that, but no one knows for sure. Hard to tell what an alien is thinking, you know? Oh, how come we haven't encountered said alien, you know? Where is said alien? <laughs> Truce. Machine village. The machines want a way of life. They all have white flags. Looks like they really don't want to fight. Hello. Machine life form. Before we begin, there's something you must understand. We are not your enemies. To be! We can't trust anything the machines say. I understand that you see us as the enemy, but, well, anyway, <laughs> my name is Pascal. I'm the leader of this village. Those who reside here desire nothing more than to live a peaceful existence. Look around for yourself. You'll see that it's true. You, we already know something of a relationship with you. In fact, I'm hoping that you can take this to an enemy of the resistance camp. What is it? It's a fuel filter that she requested. If you take it to her, it should make it clear where a piece of paper is. Alright. I like the music a lot. Ah, uh, Jean Paul. It's very, um, child. It's almost childish. Playful. It's almost playful. What's across the way? Machine with hat. Existence precedes ex essence. Man is nothing but what he makes of himself. Additionally, yes, and you are. Wait, don't not tell me. I have already deduced that you are here to listen to me expound upon the great mysteries of existence. Well enough. Let us begin discussing the <laughs> concept of existentialism. Essence and his existence are two sides of the same coin, and yet, what is existence? I'm glad you asked. The answer that it'll be long hours. This is pointless. Yep. There's no point in talking to Jean Paul. We stopped trying to figure him out a while ago. Ball like machine. All he does is spout a bunch of mumbo jumbo about something called philosophy. <laughs> How dare the robots get philosophical? <laughs> if you're curious about him, you better better luck talking to his followers. They tend at least as followers. More like fans. Some folks just get into it, I suppose. There's even one right. You know the machine with the thick paint on her face? That's the one. John Paul's Melancholy. There we go. Hello, can we ask you a question? Do you happen to know me? John Paul. He's a genius. Or absolutely, are we talking about the same John Paul here? In fact, I was thinking, how much wisdom he has to teach me? So I wrote him a letter asking for guidance. You'll take it to him, won't you? Ah, okay. Can't let that lady in the desert get to him first, or that harpy in the amusement park. Great. There are more of these weirdos? And wait, they have genders? It's like suddenly I've got a whole bunch of, like, side quests and stuff. Hello. Oh, yes, I see. Dreamers? Dreams are the mind's version of have a delivery for you. Ah, uh, allow me to see. I kind of like John Paul. He's hilarious. Well, I, that's pretty much everything. Yes, yes. Now, I may... About the letter. Right, but shouldn't you maybe respond to the letter? Is, it, is, is one duty to reply to every dispute in their direction? If such is your claim, then what power was it you placed this burden of some yoke on my... <laughs> This is a waste of time. You got that right. Actually, he said it wasn't worthy of a response. I knew it. It's the greatest. So that's it. 
no no moolah or anything all right so i guess that's it all right so this oh okay and then down Gotcha. Excuse me. I need to find my little sister. She's trying. All right. It's all. It seems she overheard me complaining about how one of my parts was starting to seize up. So she went off to search for a replacement. It's been days. I might have killed her. I might have killed her. She sure cares about. To be honest, I'm just. I'm kind of baffled with just how everything went. Just like. I, I mean, we were developing the feeling that, you know, something wasn't right with these machines. You know, like the one that had the orgy. Did I miss one? I do want to get through almost all of these here. Oh, you know what? I think it's... It was the... Don't tell me you heard tales of a genius inventor and came to see me straight away. Not really, but sure. Alright, after all, I'm your genius inventor. Very come to take whatever. Why, if you invest but a little of my efforts, I shall provide you all my desires. Well, then care to... Sure. Halfway, it's inventor accepted. Joy, elation. I had not thought myself capable of such. And just between you and I, know that if you provide enough of an investment, I'll be able to provide certain dividends in return. Now then, what do you care to invest? Do I have 10,000? What's that? Two days later. Okay. Eureka, I've done it. Feast your eyes and senses upon my new invention. Copper ore, rusted clump, broken circuit, down attack up chip, medium recovery. You're right, we set plus one. Well, last set that it has exhausted my funding. Would you care to make a new investment? In your general horrors, I would not, I would never. I, after all. I don't have the money to do all that sorts of stuff. I don't know how I feel about all that. So I'm not even going to try and attack these guys now, I think. I think the entire point is to be chill. I mean, if they're not going to attack me, I might as well not attack them. Machine with me. Oh, do you know the machine? Yes. Well, it might even go suspicious and alluring. Exactly, and I know. Won't you? I won't let that trouble go. Beautiful glass. So somehow I could kill those guys earlier without needing to pay any repercussions. I like how he just kind of zoomed in. Alright, so it almost makes me wonder if some of these robots... We're the ones that built the scaffolding. Seems almost more like that. Right. So thank you all for checking out. This is part four. So yeah, thank you for all for checking out part four of my near automata playthrough. So yeah, this episode we took on crazy scary devil opera lady robot and we we befriended a whole bunch of robots so now there's there's a, just a robot city that's like hey we want to be peaceful so my guess is is that the robots are going to be peaceful and the humans are going to turn on them because it's human nature to just kind of go with emotions still it's real interesting that these robots have emotions i don't know how they manage to manifest emotions maybe they've just been kind of studying human behavior for forever and that's how they managed to do it plus we have yet to encounter any of these so-called aliens so it's almost making me wonder if we are the aliens like really 
I don't know. I've got all these existential questions now. So, we'll see if that will ever get resolved later on. I'm pretty sure it will. But, with all that being said, thank you all so much. I'm the Anime Overanalyst, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.